All right, all right, greetings my friends. This is Ryan Groney. And so today I just wanted to get a really um, short, quick video out to you here on the digital wilderness. Um, I haven't done anything on here for a while. Um, my other channel, my main channel is gone now forever. I still have a, I still have rogue diabetic. R-O-G-U-E-D-I-A-B-E-T-I-C, which is my bit shoot account. However, I started two days ago, I started uploading a video at about almost exactly two days ago. And it's like, it's, it's still processing. It uploaded, it finished uploading, but it's still processing, so it's not, it's not viewable. At least as far as I can tell. Maybe it's uh, viewable by other people, I don't know. It's only got, it says two views, which I don't know how it could have two views. But apparently it's not like finished processing. And so it's not being shown yet. So, uh, so I, I still have that channel and there's gonna be like, I'm going to be like not able, I'm not gonna be able to say like, A whole lot on this channel because that's the way because they're like they're scared of the truth the people that are running this sham are scared of the truth and if they weren't scared of the truth they wouldn't be they wouldn't be doing this to people they wouldn't be doing it to me they would just be ignoring me That would be that would be the choice for to how to deal with a, a, a Ryan, and they would be either. Well, first of all, they shouldn't have a dog in this fight. The the social media platform shouldn't. Okay, they're immune from liability. They can't be sued for anything that I say on their channel. Now, if I were to threaten somebody, that would be a different thing. Or if I would, yeah, or if I were to be harassing somebody. But calling people stupid. Making videos to call people stupid. That's not harassment. Politicians, public officials. Okay, when, you're, when you put yourself, when you hold yourself out as a public official, as a politician, or you hold, your, hold yourself out as some sort of, you hold yourself out to criticism. That's just the way it rolls. And calling people, listen you guys, calling people names usually isn't like typically very effective criticism. Usually if you're really like, unless you're like really mad, like what I like to do when I'm really mad and when I'm obviously right, is I like to explain why, I, why I'm right and they're wrong and then wait to start calling them names and stuff until after I've done that. But if they were like, if, if what I was engaged in, or, or if what me and other people were engaged, people that have us to share similar views with me, what, if what we were engaged in was misinformation, you would just, you, or it was like, if it was misinformation, you would just, you would actually show what about it is misinformation. Which they never do. They've never done that to me. They never explained to me why any of my stuff has been misinformation. Now you'll see their little fact checks on the internets, and they're always they're always ridiculous. They're always straw man arguments, and I have no problem with I have no problem making fact checks, fact checking me with straw man arguments. What I do, what I do have a problem with is them amplifying those fact checks. First of all, I have, a, I have, a, I have, a, I have a problem with people that I haven't like, that I'm not a friend of on Facebook, spamming my posts with their commentary, with their comments. I should be able to moderate that. I should be able to keep people, if people are just spamming me and trolling me, like the CDC or whoever, or Reuters, or USA Today, or any of those dangerous animals, then I should just be able to, like, then I should be able to, like, I should have the same moderation tools available 
as any other Facebook user. And if, 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 if Reuters wants to make an original post or write an original article on why I'm wrong, that's fine. But I don't expect it to show up in my newsfeed. And I certainly don't show up to expect to show up as on my on one of my posts. See, but that's how th those people are cowards. They're they're cowards, and they don't have an argument. Coke's postulates. You have to prove shit. You can't like. You can't just make a claim. And then everybody, and then act like everybody has to, has to accept your claim is true without proving it. Okay. The microorganism must be found in abundance in those with the disease, but should not be found in, half, in, in healthy organisms. So what that means is what that means is that like if there was this, if there was some disease, some viral or some, probably even shouldn't have said that, some contagious disease that was spreading around from one person to another person through the air. Okay. And the cause of it was some was a microorganism. <laughs> then, then, and, or and, if the cause of it was a microorganism, and this in the in the microorganism that was alleged to be the cause was being found in healthy people that would mean that would mean that the microorganism isn't the cause of, of the disease so they, and they, they can't they can't argue with that Okay. Unfortunately for me, that's a hard argument to make once everybody's like, because everybody's accepted the premise. Because every single dummy out in the, in the entire universe just accepted the, the, their premise without, without like the, the um, Demanding any sort of proof without requiring any sort of proof that they prove their premise Then they came out then they came out and they, they, they started lying to us And admittedly lying to us They came out and they started telling us that they were going to even though they hadn't established a causal link between the microorganism and the disease, they told us that they were going to pay doctors money. They began paying doctors money to, to label people who died as having died with, of, of, from, as a causal effect of the disease caused by this microorganism. That they claim that they're finding in both healthy and unhealthy people. And nobody, nobody did it and like, no, that was not a problem for anyone. So, I don't know what to tell you guys anymore. But this one, this, we're pro I'm probably just going to have to keep this channel pretty Bible, which is fine. Because that's what's like, I mean, that's, I mean, that's actually what's important anyway. I know what these people are up to and what's going on. So that'll have to be 
what we talk about here. But I'll still have rogue diabetic. I'll still try to get stuff up on it. But it's gonna it's becoming increasingly difficult difficult and if I do find like if I should somehow find some other platform that's like at least as functional as YouTube used to be then I'll let you guys know until then like share subscribe I'm out